So now let's see how we can work around with object alignment inside of Google Data Studio. So to align out objects, first of all, I'm going to go around and bring in some shapes right here. So here I have a rectangular shape, as you can see. So there's another rectangular shape. And I'm going to bring in a, um, a rectangular shape right here as well, and a circle over here as well, as you can see. That is a noble because I'm not um, actually creating this exactly as a circle right here. So now, uh, once you actually bring this in, you can see that they are not well lined together. So you can eyeball it around and keep it together. But if you want them to be automatically aligned, then you can select all of them by clicking and dragging around the shape right here. And then you can go around onto arenes. And here you can see align is an option. So you can go around onto align horizontally and click left right here. So everything is aligned out to the left as you can see. You can press control Z to go back. And over here you can go around over here into arenes and align it to the center over here as well. So everything is arenes out to the center by aligning horizontally right here. Go around and click on right and uh, align it to the right. Similarly, you can go around and align it to the top right here. You can align it to the middle right here as well. And you can align it over here onto the bottom over here as well. So you can see that whenever you align, it takes the um, uh, takes the space um, in between the selection itself. So if I were to go around onto a range and then if I were to go around onto middle then what happens is that it takes this particular space and aligns it to the middle right there and you can go around align it let's say for example on the center then it takes everything this space right here and aligns it to the center and that is how you can align out objects inside of Google Data Studio so hope you guys learn something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe